Hello, welcome to Tunisia's Locks and Beauty Tips. I'm Tunisia Ali and today I am reviewing the NYX setting powder. It's called Mineral Finishing Powder, okay? I got this from Ulta for $9.99 was the regular price, but today they had buy to get one free. And so I picked up some eyeshadow and this. So I'm not sure the exact price, but I also saw it at Target and it was like $10.49 or $9.99. So um, this is what it looks like. Uh, when you open it, you actually won't see the powder. And me being a novice at this, I was like, well, how the heck am I supposed to get the damn powder out? And why doesn't anybody say this? So I started looking on YouTube. Nobody was talking about it. So I'm like, okay, what's going on? What's going on? So I just took a few... Um, took a, a pen, a hairpin, and poked a few holes in there, shaked it up, shook it up, <laughs> and this is what I actually got, okay? So what I'm going to do first, because when I came home, I actually took off what was underneath my eyes. I have always had a problem with uh, bags or dark circles. Um, they've changed over the years. So anyway, bottom line is what I'm going to do is first put on a little bit of my concealer, and I'm not turning a lot of it up because I have some on here anyway from earlier, okay? So I'm just gonna put a little bit of concealer on, kind of blend that in some. Usually when I put on my concealer, um, I always like to make sure that it's not too heavy. I don't want it to go into the creases of my eyes and look crazy. Uh, sometimes I put it on under my foundation, other times I put it on top. This happens to be Tommy Ford. But I imagine you definitely don't need to spend this for a decent concealer. So different days I use different things sometimes. Sometimes I just use a matte foundation, two different color foundations. But anyway, that's what we're doing there. So once I get that in there, there's a tad bit of a different color. I'm going to add just a tiny bit of NARS foundation, just a little. And I like to first let this kind of blend in a little, not blend in, but dry some. And so let the concealer dry just a couple of minutes, you know, and now I'm just going to blend this in. Now, remember this foundation brush already has a little bit of foundation on it already. Okay. So I'm just blending things in very nicely. And now I am going to take my NYX, all right? And I'm just gonna put my brush in there. And remember, from what I hear, this is supposed to be matte. Um, typically, they have pretty good matte, mattifying products. I'm gonna say close your eyes because the powder is kind of going up in my eye. And you just wanna brush very lightly. This is to set my makeup. It doesn't feel heavy. Wow, wow, look at that. I like that. What do you guys think, huh? Supposed to be all day coverage. And so I like the way that looks. It gives me a nice smoothness, I think. Yeah, I like that. I like that. Okay, ladies. So this is what the NYX Mineral Matte Finishing Powder looks like. Now, this particular color here is the medium. Uh, it's the medium light. No, I'm sorry. It's the medium dark. They did have a light color. I felt it was a little too light. This is kind of in the middle and you can see what the color of my skin is. But bear in mind, this is not really going to leave a film on your skin. It's just going to set. And I believe they also had a translucent color uh, of a different type. But this actually works out really well and I like the way it looks. Um, it does. It feels very comfortable. It doesn't feel heavy. It's like barely there. So ladies, if you like this and you want more, please leave a comment. If you have any questions about this particular product, let me know. If you uh, enjoyed this little tidbit, please subscribe, like, or share, and uh, join me for more beauty tips.